Hello to everyone that watches this. I am providing you with this wonderful update for those of you that may have any questions regarding your vacation destinations amidst this COVID-19 pandemic and severe problem. As some of you may or may not at this point be aware of, on today, from today's date, June 21st, 2020, that the Walt Disney World Resort is going to undergo a phased reopening of their location in Florida. The first two parks that are going to open up are the Magic Kingdom and Disney's Animal Kingdom. And for those of you that are animal lovers, this is absolutely wonderful. One of the rides that I strongly recommend is you go on Kilimanjaro Safari and you go early in the morning because most of the animals there are, are nocturnal, so they sleep during the day. And you are going to get much more benefit out of it than what you would the other way around. And also, if everything goes according to plan, they are also going to be opening Dizzy's Epcot. It stands for Experimental Prototype City of Tomorrow. And Dizzy's Hollywood Studios on June... Blah, 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 sorry, not June. On July 15th. Now, not all of the resorts are going to be opening up. Let me make that quite clear. The resorts that are going to be opening up are in the order as follows. D Disney's Bay Lake Tower and Disney's Contemporary Resort. The Fort Wilderness Lodge. Cooper Creek. Or C Copper Creek. Sorry, my bad. Copper Creek Villas and Cabins at Disney's Fort Wilderness Lodge. D Disney's Animal Kingdom Villas, D Disney's Beach Club Villas, Disney's Boardwalk Villas, Disney's Fort Wilderness Resort and Campgrounds, which for those of you that may be campers, this is a wonderful opportunity for you to bring your camper and <clears throat> enjoy your stay there. It is very cheap, but I personally find it slightly distasteful because you're not really coming to Walt Disney World to camp. You're going there to see the most magical place on earth and you are going to be running around like a chicken with your head cut off while you're there. D Disney's old Key West Resort, Disney's Polynesian Resort, Disney's Polynesian Villas, D Disney's Riviera Resort, Disney's Saratoga Springs Resort, which I have stayed at six times, and Disney's, v the villas at Disney's Grand Floridian Resort and Spa. This is beyond everything that a lot of people have wanted. I know a lot of people have wanted to have a new sense of normalcy. I can tell you, I personally, myself, am ready to get back to a new sense of normalcy. I am more than happy to help you with anything and everything that you may need. And any other vacation destinations, I do have some more information, but I will be adding that information at a later time. Probably sometime within the next month or two, because I am in the process of moving from one location to the next, so the there might be a brief lapse in videos. So I will update you all further when I have new information. Please, if you have any questions regarding any vacation destinations, I do not care whether it is big or small, I am more than happy to help you. I will be, the, my contact information will be listed below in the description. Thank you very much for your time. Have a magical day, evening, afternoon, or wherever you are. Stay safe, stay healthy, and we will all get through this together. And on a side note, I will be absolutely remiss if I did not congratulate the, the graduating class of 2020 for showing extreme resilience in the torture that you all have had to go through. The challenges that you have faced have surpassed anybody's imagination, and you have all flew right through with flying colors and taken it as you have your compassion your determination is inspiring thank you very much once again stay safe stay healthy i will be speaking to you all soon